The Atomic Bomb Commission of the United States of America presents Project X. Sponsored by, in Cupid's little bag of tricks, here's the one that clicks with chicks, Burma Shave. Barsteiner. There's a Johnny Ireland here to see you. Thank you, Lola. Send him in, please. Right this way, Mr. Ireland. Dr. Barsteiner. Johnny Ireland. Mr. Ireland. Call me Johnny. Doc. Johnny? My secretary, Lola Luciani. She's not much on shore, Dan. She makes a mean cup of joe. And quite a looker, Doc. Ma'am. Mr. Ireland, can I offer you a cappuccino? A cup of what now? Okay. Uh, Lola, just two cups of coffee will be fine. Yes, sir. So what can I do for you today, Johnny? Doctor, today I'm here to talk about OPSEC. That's right, Operation Security, or OPSEC. Well, it's a swell new program, Doc. And I think as an atomic test director around here, you need to know more about it. Sounds interesting, Johnny. Interesting, but complicated. Well, Operation Security, or OPSEC, isn't complicated at all, Doc. Why well, I would think an old atom crusher such as yourself won't have any problem understanding it. Well, of course I can understand it, Johnny. I'm an atomic scientist. But the real question is, is whether you can explain it to someone as intelligent as I. Why, sure, Doc. I think I can dumb it down just enough for even your average atomic scientist would be able to understand it. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Johnny, all kidding aside, tell me about Operation Security, or OPSEC. Why, sure, Doc. Well, let's say you've got an upcoming atomic test, Doc. Well, we are, but that's secret. So don't let the cat out of the bag. Well, jeepers, Doc, what do you take me for? Some kind of Clyde? Why well, won't let the cat out of the bag? But tell me this, Doc. How are you going to protect all the information about your secret atomic test? Well, that's easy, Johnny. Everyone knows you don't talk about secret stuff to anyone without a clearance. Well, except for your wife, your secretary. Well. Well, sure, Doc. Everyone knows that. Heck, they're practically cleared anyway. But let me ask you this, Doc. How are you going to protect all the unclassified, sensitive information about your upcoming secret test? I don't need to protect that information. It's unclassified. If it were important, it'd be classified, right? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Slow down there, Doc. Slow down. Let me explain this to you. At your upcoming test, before that can happen, why have thousands of events need to happen before that can happen? That's right, Johnny. The atomic test site will be busier than Joe McCarthy hunting down those commies. God bless old Joe, Doc. But let me ask you this. How many of those events that are going to be taking place will actually be classified events, Doc? Well, hypothetically, there are 10,000 separate events taking place. Approximately 103.752 of those events would be classified, which leaves... 9,896.248 unclassified events taking place. But what's your point? We have to assume the communists are going to see some of those 9,896.248 events. And let me ask you this. What would happen, Doc, if they were to see perhaps only 3% of those events, Doc? Well, based on the information available to me and the data that you've presented, if the commies observed 296.8874 unclassified events leading up to a secret atomic test. They'd be able to figure out that we're having a secret atomic test. And that's no good, Doc. No good at all. No. No, it isn't, Johnny. But what can I do? I'm just a simple atomic scientist. Use Operation Security, Doc. Use Operation Security, or OPSEC, to save us from those pesky commies. As the Atomic OPSEC manager begins to explain the Operation Security, or OPSEC, process to the head of atomic testing, let's take a moment to review the Operation Security, or OPSEC, process. The Operation Security, or OPSEC, process has five steps. Each of these steps builds upon the other so that at the end of the process, you have succeeded in identifying your critical information, analyzing the threat, analyzing your own vulnerabilities to the threat, determining the risk based on your vulnerabilities and the threat, and developed security measures that would lessen the risk to our operations. 
Sure, that's a whopper of a sentence, and you may not grasp the full meaning yet. But let's listen in as Johnny Ireland uses the upcoming secret atomic test to explain Operation Security, or OPSEC, to Atomic Test Director Dr. Linus Warsteiner. <laughs> 